Hi guys, I am Ganesh Thakur. Welcomes you all on our channel ABT Gurukul. In this video, we will see bacteriophage. So before we proceed further, first like this video and share it with your friends. Subscribe this channel and press the bell icon to get the notification of our new video. You may follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. The Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter ID link is given in the video description box. Guys, here is a question for you. Watch full video and write your answer in comment box. The question is, what is most widely used bacteriophage? So comment your answer. We look forward to your reply. Now come to the topic. Bacteriophages are virus which infect the bacterial cell. Bacteriophages are widely used as cloning vector in genetic engineering. as they have ability to replicate in host cell bacteriophages infect bacterial cells by injecting their dna into the bacterial cell the viral dna injected into the cell replicates and expresses itself in the host cell resulting in the formation of several phages which lyse the bacterial cell and come out this property of bacteriophage to transfer its dna and genome into a specific bacterial host cell during infection is used in genetic engineering most widely used bacteriophage are lambda phage and m13 phage so let's see lambda phage lambda phage has a double stranded linear dna with 48.5 kilo base pair in length of which 12 bases at each end are unpaired but are complementary these sticky or cohesive ends are called the cos site that is cohesive end sites of 12 base pair a large portion in the central region of the genome of lambda phage is not necessary for the lytic cycle of the virus in e coli cells so vector have been designed in such a way that this region is substituted by of foreign dna they allow cloning of fragments up to 23 kb in size now let's see m13 phage this phage infects the e coli cells which have pili it is filamentous with a genome of single stranded circular dna of 6407 bases when the dna of m13 phage is injected into the bacterial cell it forms double stranded dna known as the replicative form after replication it forms about 100 copies in the cell single stranded dna copies of the genome are generated and extruded from the cell as m13 phage particles now let's see the advantage of m13 phage or m13 vector its genome is small and less than 10 kb in size its replicative form can be isolated purified and manipulated exactly like a plasmid genes cloned can be obtained as single stranded dna which are useful for different purposes like dna sequencing site directed mutagenesis etc that's it in this video we will come back soon with a new topic like subscribe and share our channel stay with us thanks for watching jai hind